what really caught my eye about ATMs was just the ROI is crazy, potentially crazy cash flow. When I heard how much they cost, I was like, oh my God, this is a drop in the bucket compared to some of the other things I've been investing in. Hello everyone, this is Andrea coming to you from ATMtogether.com and tonight we have Mike Rumble. Mike, are you there? I am. Tell me a little bit about yourself. I'm uh, actually in healthcare, so I'm a pharmacist. Um, I've been in pharmacy since uh, 2009, so for quite a while. Um, I've worked uh, mostly for a big company. I worked for Kroger for a really long time okay. and I actually just transitioned to a smaller uh, company local company, so kind of changing things up. Uh, family background, I come from a pretty blue collar black background, so not a lot of uh, healthcare professionals or anything like that. It's a lot yes. of yeah, blue collar workers. So looking okay. to uh, expand my investments and kind of get some more passive income growing on the side. Before the ATM arena, had you embarked on anything else like as a side hustle? What really kind of opened my eyes to it and just seeing the power of making your money work for you and passive income was actually like doing a little bit of day trading with stocks and crypto. So that kind of okay. got my toes in the water and like opened my eyes to like, oh wow, there's, you know, there's something else out here besides just trading your time for money and, you know, yes. working for a salary. So that was where I started. Um, I joined up with another mastermind group. Um, okay. They kind of, they do crypto and real estate. Um, so I got an Airbnb going that's being okay. managed for me. So very passive side um, with some pretty steady cash flow coming in. Yes. And I have some crypto miners, which crypto is just, you know, all over the place. Exactly. So right now, not a great time, but I'm looking at more of a long term play. And that's, you know, completely hands off. So I have these uh, crypto miners that are being hosted somewhere else that I don't right. even have to deal with. Um, I just get the rewards that come in every day. Yes. So I'm looking at that as just kind of like a sit and, you know, sit and hold. And then the um, the real estate play is more of just like steady cash flow coming in. Right. Um, looking for growth in that area. And this was what really caught my eye about ATMs was just the ROI is crazy. Yeah. It's exactly like, you know, the plays that I'm used to with depreciating the asset and uh, having those tax advantages while still having yes. cr potentially crazy cash flow. And exactly. when I heard how much they cost, I was like, Oh my God, this is like, why not? <laughs> yeah, this is no joke. Like this is a drop in the bucket compared to some of the other things I've been investing in with much right. better upside. Um, how was your communication with the team compared to some of the other things you've gotten into? I haven't seen such a responsive group and anything else that I'm in. So, I mean, it's like instant. They tell you it's nine to five, but it's like, I'll just, you know, randomly at night, I'll be laying awake thinking of something. I'll just shoot a message. And I'm like, I'm not expecting a response or anything like that. But to my my amazement, they always get back like right away. Or right. they're, you know, whoever sees it is tagging someone else that can help me. So yeah, it feels like, like I definitely don't feel like I'm in this alone, which is awesome because it is, you know, a brand new thing for me. But yeah, right. the communication's been great. The support's been great. How was it for you starting a business with people you've never essentially met. I think it was pretty easy. It was very similar it's with my other investments. I do have a business as well. So it was kind of that same thing where, you know, I didn't necessarily know these people. Um, you know, I'd followed them on social media and actually in the other business, I knew somebody that knew somebody. Whereas this right. was literally, I was scrolling through Instagram. I saw Paul's story. I looked up his website. I was looking at things he was saying, and I'm not even kidding you. It was the next day I had a, a call with Gettem and I joined. So it was more of just like, I don't know, it's, I'm trying not to have that analysis paralysis and just right. going with my gut and like everything I saw, everything I was being told just sounded good. And then my call with Gadam went great. So it, awesome. it made me comfortable. So yeah, I, I don't know, maybe it's crazy. Some people would probably hear that and be like, dude, you didn't do any research. Like, no. <laughs> right. And this is, you scared money doesn't make money. So <laughs> that's where yes, I was Yes, I love that. And I also like to say money making money just makes sense. So you were like me, like within the first 24 hours I sat, literally went through all the testimonials. At the time, there were only like 23. I spent the whole 24 hours watching all the videos, reading the comments, and then my call was with you. And I'm like, I'm ready, where do I sign up? Just, just let me know, you know, like, what do I do? Just take my money. Now, this is something you've never done. ATMs are different for you, is well outside of the realm of pharmacy. 
So how was the training and the comfortability with getting to know your business? It was, it was super easy. I think for me, the biggest thing that I really liked about the ATMs was that there's a lot to real estate. And like every time I looked at getting further and like growing my real estate portfolio, I always would just get overwhelmed. And I'd yes. you know, sit there and be like, oh my God, you know, how do I track this? What goes where? And yes. this just made so much sense because it's like, I don't know, it just seemed like not to downplay it or anything, but like dumbed down, like it's really, really simple. Yeah. Um, the training was great. I do have some some experience with tools and stuff. So that mm -hmm. came naturally as far as the install. Um, and I'm comfortable with computers, so programming it was really easy. But I mean, even without that knowledge, I think it would be super easy because it is all laid out for you. They make it as easy as possible. Like, right. you know, my two-year-old son could probably do it. What would you say to someone who's on the fence about joining the business? I like what you said, honestly. Go through the testimonials. Like, don't just take what Paul says and what Gedim says and the people yeah. that actually work for the company. Go listen to people that are actually doing this. Um, I love the value that the free uh, Facebook group offers. Yeah. So like join that, talk to people. You can ask questions like there's already somebody that hit me up when I posted my install yeah. um, and was asking me questions, you know, where do I get started? What do I do? And I was just kind of like, just set up a call and talk to them. Like right. they, you don't need to do this by yourself. And by all means, they make it so you can like all right. the resources are out there. They have so much free content um, that they give you. So that's what I would say. Join the free Facebook group. Um, listen to the testimonials, reach out to people. Don't be afraid to, you know, send DMs to people that are in the yes. Facebook group and just be like, hey, how's your experience been? These are people all across the country that you might not know. Talk to somebody. There's, it says how many members are in Columbus with me. Just be yes. one of them. How was your engagement with your merchant? He was on board. He wanted an ATM and I got, I got a little, uh, I don't know, a little curveball when I walked in because he, he starts talking to me and he's like, yeah, man, I was actually thinking about starting up at an ATM business because he and his wife own the shop together. So I'm already like, oh, like, do you really want me to come in here or do you want my advice? Like, where are you going with this? Right, but I right. thought that was kind of cool too, because I know, you know, and I don't know if everyone knows this, that's just, you know, looking to get into this. They don't just teach you how to buy the ATM, vault it and install it. They teach you all the other options, which I thought was really cool, you know, all right. the other, uh, sales tactic, tactics you can use with ATMs. So I'm already thinking like, man, if this doesn't work out, I could just sell this to them. That way I don't have to worry about uninstalling it. Go buy another exactly. one, rinse and repeat. So yeah, it was kind of cool. He's been, um, he's real easy to get along with. Um, he was he was down when I told him about the ATM. Um, he was ready to get it installed. So it's been smooth. Um, we text every now and then, and I'm gonna stop in uh, before too long and talk to him get some advice on how we can in increase traffic to it. Is there anything else you want to share with anyone who may be visiting or viewing this video at a later date? Yeah, I think it's really important to invest in yourself first. So yeah. that's the biggest thing I learned. Um, I look at this, any of these mastermind groups that you can get into is a good idea. Yeah. Um, if you're looking to start a business or I mean, you just got to surround yourself with people that are already doing it. I think that's the biggest thing join a community, talk to people that are already doing it. Like you said, not only does ATM Together have uh, the resources within their company, they have a huge community behind them too. Every single day there's people installing ATMs. So yes. I mean, there's hundreds and hundreds of people that you can talk to actually, a thousand in the clients only group, plus exactly. all the employees, plus the what, almost 50,000 people in the free Facebook group. That's what I would say. Thank you so much, Mike. I really appreciate your time. We appreciate you for joining the team and we wish you more success. Absolutely. Thank you so much. All I right. can't wait to keep growing. Amen.